What is going on everyone? It's Bray with Jacoji Fine Jewelry, your personal jeweler. What is all this new filming location? If Amazon wasn't taking their sweet time, these props would be there, but I got a nice little neck there with a two chain, three and a half millimeter Franco. Don't worry, once I get it right, it's gonna be looking right. This video today I had to rush because a lot of people have been asking and I promised the angel wing pendants are back. My most popular pendant by far um, over the long term, I took them down because I, what I do best is make every size for everybody. That is my biggest accomplishment, honestly, for me looking back is to be able to bring the tiny, mini, standard, and large sizes to most of these pieces. I'm going to show you guys, do a complete review so you guys can check them out. I love the angel wing pendants. I'll show you why. With that being said, Let's get started. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Jacoji Fine Jewelry. I need more followers. Give me a follow. I promise it'll be good. Visit my website, www.jacoji.com and smash, 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 smash that like button. Smash. And here they are. They're very similar to the one that I had on the website. I took the border out and gave a little more texture feathers to them as well as made different sizes from left to right. We have the tiny the mini, the standard, and the large sizes. And you could reference this is a good thing because between the standard and large, there's a pretty big jump in gram weight as well as price. So you gotta know what you're looking for, the look. I'll talk about each size and what I like about them and kinda to help you guys shop for the perfect pendant. As far as the chains go on the website and as you're seeing these, the tiny has the one millimeter Franco, the mini has the 1.2 millimeter, the standard, the one and a half millimeter, and then the large size on a two and a half millimeter, all diamond cut 14 karat gold Francos. The first wing we're gonna talk about is the tiny angel wing. Now this is my lightest tiny piece that I've made. When I make the tiny pieces, it is not for men, it's for women's more for charm size, a great gift idea, or if you are a female watching this, this you gotta think charm size, something to hang up top, 16, 18 inch thin chain, and just wear it as a little charm. It's about a little over a half gram in weight, so very light, and from top to bottom, we have half inch. Now with the angel wings, we're not talking half inch when we're saying a Buddha pendant, which has a lot more width to it, which increases the overall size. These are very narrow, skinny, so a half inch doesn't really look like a half inch, if you guys get the point. That's why I say with tiny, I name them specifically to help with the transparency. It is very tiny. Over half gram is not a lot. Most of my tiny pieces are one gram and above, so this is half that size. Um, there's nothing that I wouldn't would say is wrong with durability. It's just because of how narrow it is, it doesn't require a lot of weight. But tiny size, you gotta think female, a charm size, something simple that you could wear with like a 16, 18 inch on display with a one millimeter diamond cut Franco. You could go one millimeter rope or a one and a half millimeter rope. I wouldn't go much above that because you really don't need to do so. Next, we have the mini size, weighing about two grams and 14 karat gold. That is very light compared to the other mini size pendants on my website for the same reasons I just talked about, Tiny. That's where you really have to look at the side by sides and see what you're comfortable with. Look at these images. I think mini size is great for a starter pendant, just something to add to the collection because with pendants, you want to keep them on rotation, switch it up, different chains. I would not try to fit this on a two millimeter Franco or a three millimeter rope. I get people all the time email me about the mini size. I have a four millimeter rope. Will a mini size fit? Should I do it? I say no. One, I think it's a little too small. I would go simple. This is on a 1.2 millimeter Franco, which works perfectly. Even the 1.2 millimeter is plenty of chain for this mini size. You do not want to um, devalue your chain by putting a smaller pendant on there because it just makes it kind of look goofy. So you gotta size them up right. You could even get away with a one millimeter Franco, a one millimeter rope, one and a half millimeter rope. Like that, I would not push it above two millimeters for the mini size. Again, good everyday pendant if you're just starting out or want something simple to wear an angel wing because that's kind of what the whole design and meaning is. This is a very casual wear. The mini size works for a lot of people. I do like it, but again, really watch this video as well as other videos to really try to gauge the mini size the best you can. And now we have the standard size. In my opinion, the standard size is the best size. If you're looking for an angel wing and you have a decent size chain, go with the standard size. Eight grams, which is decent, 
and then we have one and three quarters inches top to bottom including the bell i like the size i'm not a guy that loves huge pendants you see me with the goat pendant it's very small that's what i like but the standard size really shows the details of that angel wing you have the weight of eight grams which is good if you go with 18 karat a little bit heavier but i think the standard size is going to work the most or the best for most people because of the weight overall size the detail you just get a very nice piece for the price if you went with a different standard size it's gonna weigh a little bit more and be more expensive so as far as pendant as far as looks if you want something that gives you a good look the standard angel wing is the absolute best buy that you could possibly purchase um, I know I'm gonna probably put one on a Franco and wear it most of every day That's how much I like the standard size. I love the angel wing It is a very good design with detail So I like the standing out and I I like the meaning of the angel wing as well The standard size offers a lot for everybody last but not least is the large size angel wing I made this for the people that have the three and a half four millimeter Franco six millimeter rope chains the thicker size chains that you want a pendant that can keep up with two and a half inches top to bottom 20 grams and 14 karat gold it's a very nice pendant that has the presence around the neck with the increased surface space of course you're going to get more detail shown with the feathers the overall angel wing the beautiful finish on these pendants it's a very nice thing so if you have a thicker chain and want a heavy a nice size pendant go with the large size because that's exactly what you're going to get one last look at all the different sizes i'm really excited to bring multiple different sizes the tiny mini standard large to the website with a product that i love the angel wing and a lot of you guys will too and you can mix and match these you could go like one of the most popular looks that i used to recommend to people would be like a 24 26 and then take like two standards so they slightly overlap the double angel wing is really cool or you could wear them at the same length it's just you could have fun with them wear them with a the cross wear them with the jesus piece or if you have a different piece and just mix and match them they're not like something that's crazy weight compared to other pieces so you could have them and just switch them up wear them whenever you feel like it very nice pieces go on the website check them out thank you guys for watching thank you for the support that's it for today's video and we'll see you on our next jewelry video.